In this video, we are going to show you how to perform the Hoffa's test for infrapatellar fat pad syndrome, also known as Hoffa syndrome. Enroll in our online course now. Link is in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. The infrapatellar fat pad is an intracapsular and extrasynovial adipose tissue occupying the anterior knee joint from the inferior pole of the patella to the proximal tibia. As it is highly vascularized and innervated, impingement of the infrapatellar fat pad is a potential source of nociception, causing anterior knee pain that is often overlooked. To perform the test, have the patient in supine lying position with the knee flexed to 30 to 60 degrees. With one hand, the examiner supports the tibia from dorsally while he exerts direct pressure on the medial and lateral side of the inferior pole of the patella. The same process is repeated with the knee in extension. This test is positive for patella fat pad impingement if the patient reports increased pain upon pressure on either side in the extended position compared to the flexed position. Be aware that infrapatellar fat pad impingement needs to be differentiated from joint line pain due to anterior horn meniscus tears. In the playlist linked above, you will find various meniscus tests that can help you in your diagnosis. All right, this was our video on the Hoffers test. If you want to learn how to distinguish it from other pathologies that can cause anterior knee pain, click on the video right next to me. Do you want to learn about screening, diagnosis and treatment of the most common pathologies in the lower and upper extremities? Check out our online course on study.physiotutors.com. As always, this was Kai for Physiotutors. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.